abandoned cars lying around Fortune Valley. Some kind of house deal gone wrong, maybe. Anyhow, if you find them, why don't you bring them around to the airfield? Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> hey there, everyone. It's BT and Kiwi back here again with another Need for Speed Payback Abandoned Car Guide. So, firstly, um, something I keep been keeping on forgetting to do the last few ones. A shout out to one of my subscribers, RJ the Hazard Boy 22. He asked if I could do a shout out for him since he comments on a on a few of my Need for Speed Payback guides. Um, so yeah, shout out to him. And let's get straight into it. We're up to another abandoned car. Jeez, already up to March. Where's the time gone in this year? So We are looking at Udo Roth's Subaru WRX STI, and it should be right around here. Very top of the map, top center, almost right where the color changes for the area. Um, and it's right by our billboard, so that's a nice little bonus. And here is the fast travel point. So you want to come along this road here and do one of the jumps over to where you would normally get this little token. I believe that's floating in the air. And that's the way to get this billboard here and our um, abandoned car. <laughs> And also one of the car derelicts parts are right here, I believe, too. Gotcha. Alright, hopefully we have some better luck getting this back to Ravs than what we did with the last car. Okay, this isn't going too well. Can I make it over? Yes. I'll take it. Thank goodness for four wheel drive. There's a car for an off road car, it's so unstable. And for a four wheel drive. That's normally why I pick them in my car games because they're very stable. Something just got the wheels off the ground. 
Come on, car, your four wheel drive stop started losing grip and spinning out. Now the game wants you to drift and slide, which I don't, I want to do it when I choose to do it. I think that cop took himself out from the hole. Nice and easy, that was quite a simple one. It was a bit hairy at times, but aside from that, a job well done. Nice car you found there. I think this is like my second or third one. It's nothing too fancy, it's just the one that everyone knows and has seen if you've played it. Because you see this car very early on in the story. Garage Queen, that's what she's going to be until I sell her. Pull out my maxed out R34. So yeah, that's that's it. I'm going to quickly I'm gonna show the map again of where it is. But um yeah, if you guys enjoyed the stream or enjoyed the video and it helped you, then hit that follow button and I'll be exporting this to my YouTube channel as well, which I I'm guessing most of you will probably be watching this from so um, if you're not and you're on Twitch uh, then you can follow the link underneath my live stream panel to my YouTube channel I upload clips and stuff there including my past streams so that's the benefit of that and if you check that out and like what you see then why not hit the subscribe button and help support me there would help a lot and I'd very much appreciate it um, so yeah this is once again right where the this billboard is here so you want to come from here on this road and take the jump and jump across the canyon onto these other roads here you can slightly see where it's smoothed out on the map and then it's just sitting right here nice and easy and the fastest spot to fast travel to is the gas station right here which just so happens to be right by this dealership the race dealership so you can fast travel to the dealership or to the gas station, doesn't matter. Um, so yeah, uh, drop a comment on stuff you want to do next or things you can do better with. And, um, or just general constructive criticism and always, always. Um, hope everyone's having a great day or a great night wherever in the world you are. Peace out everyone, have a great one.